Sai, you have two saber handles down. Whitson and uh, Fisher currently performing what are known as buddy checks, basically checking each other's uh, spacesuit configuration. And uh, the simplified aid for EVA rescue, the handles on that, uh, on each jetpack that they wear. In the unlikely event, they would require the use of those jetpacks to fly back to the safety of the uh, space station. Yeah, I believe it's Venus station, is that correct? Yes, that is affirmative, the Zenith stanchion. Okay, that's on and latch. Do I need to loosen it all the way, make it work with the others? Yeah, that's not far enough. No, this one. And of course, we'll leave that ratchet uh, tethered to the crew lock bag, and you can then translate to the failed XPECA H1. Nader. I wonder if you could do uh, vertically on that frame handrail. I don't know. And Peggy, see that you've got your BRT. You think you've got a good body position to break torque? Let's see if I can get it in here. Just let me, let me know when you're ready for motion. I'm ready, buddy. Okay, in and mark. And be prepared to stop here while I rotate that back around. No problem. You can bend at the knees. Okay, so we're starting motion then. Yes, sir. Please. Copy. Got a red on it. I'm uh, locking it out, and then I have two lock scoops. Perfect. And good pin, clean channel, the bolting, and let me click on the nader. Ma'am? Here, I can move it. Okay, Peggy, you see you making your way up and that you're immediately below that uh, smooth aluminum panel with the decal on it. To Up to your left, immediately behind the radiator, there's a, a good um, stanchion underneath MLI. So you can touch that stanchion. Of course, uh, remember, only light touch on the radiator. Three hours, 28 minutes into today's spacewalk, an outstanding view of uh, Jack Fisher as he makes his way uh, towards the Columbus module to retrieve a portable foot restraint. sort of cable that looks an awful lot like a gap spinner. Be tempting. I won't touch it though. On this 200th spacewalk in support of space station assembly and maintenance, a scintillating view of Jack Fisher as the International Space Station flies directly over Acapulco. Do we need over there? We'll do them here. Great question. Um, your settings are going to be six, clocking of six, and it's going to be Tango Tango Echo One. Tango, Tango, Echo One. Good words. And uh, Peggy, see you at the at the airlock. And Peggy, you are go to uh, open the um, hatch thermal cover at this time and start working on uh, stowing your ex Pekka and crew lock bag. Monster. Approaching the west coast of Peru, Jack Fisher, with the uh, articulating portable foot restraint that will be attached uh, to the side of pressurized mating adapter number three. This uh, to be pre-staged for future spacewalking activity involving uh, that work site to which an international docking adapter will be attached for commercial crew vehicle dockings in the, in the uh, years ahead. When it's all said and done, the only two tasks that appear to be left undone today are lower priority tasks, that being the installation of uh, wireless antennas on the Destiny Laboratory and the installation of a high-definition camera out on the truss of the station, that work to be picked up on a future 
EVA.